everyone. In this lecture, we'll see the most confusing thing in electrical engineering, that is horsepower. We normally come across horsepower term in machines lab, and we get confused one horsepower is equal to how much? Is it 746 or 735.5 watts? In this lecture, we'll see on what basis these two numbers are evolved. And for 1 HP in electrical terms, how much should we take? Let's see to it. James Watt is a Scottish inventor who has introduced the word horsepower. When he wanted to compare or when he wanted to quantify his steam engine's output power, he had to take use of horse power. So he compared his engine with the horse which is carrying 180 pound and at a speed of 180.96 feet per meter. He said a power of horse is equal to 180 into the speed which is turns out to be 32,572.8 and he has rounded to 33,000 feet pound per minute. So if we convert this number into SS system, there are the conversion figures. If we convert this to SI, you will get 745.6 watt. So this conversion is according to the British standards. Later on, if you consider metric system, he had to compare again the power of engine with the horse lifting 75 kilos weight to a height of 1 meter against to the gravity 9.80665. So as we know gravity changes from different locations so has taken standard acceleration gravity which is 9.80665. So if you multiply these two it turns out to be 735.5 watt. So one metric HP is equal to this much, one British HP is equal to this much. Now what if somebody is asking one electrical HP is equal to how much? You may think only these two HPs are existing but along with these two there are many other horsepowers are existing. One is boiler HP, hydraulic HP, air HP. Likewise you have electrical HP also. One electrical HP is equal to 746 watt. So from now, if somebody is asking one electrical HP, then you will say 746 watt. If somebody says one metric HP, then you will, you will use this figure. Thanks for watching the video. Please react to the video by clicking like and please share your valuable comments which helps us to improve the quality of the lectures and you may click here to subscribe. Thanks for watching.